Hey, Philip again. Today, I want to show you how I make a commercial. The good thing about this particular commercial is that it stands out really well on its own, but it could also work as an example of a previous for a commercial. First step is that an agency or a client would contact me with a commercial and then I would write a pitch or an idea, a presentation of how I see the commercial. In this case, it's a make-believe commercial and I sent it to the make-believe client and they really loved it. They said, this is the most amazing commercial idea we've ever seen in the world and <laughs> it's going to change the world. <laughs> My idea was to present a commercial for a bakery brand and particularly a really well-known croissant. And my idea was that there was a certain amount of people in a bakery that was going crazy about getting a croissant. And I wanted to present it in a Renaissance style painting with the posing and freeze frame it and move the camera around and finally reveal a croissant in a beautiful cinematic lighting. Then I go scouting for a location and I found this really great looking bakery that I think is a perfect setting for this commercial. After I set the location, I then start placing the characters in the various poses. And as you can see, I place them one by one. I start building or modeling or sculpting my scene with the characters in different poses and I inventing as I go. And what I like about this commercial is to add a little bit of bizarreness to it and add a bit of humor to the situation in the poses and the expressions of the characters. And as you can see, I keep inventing poses, I keep inventing new gags as I'm going along. I am also setting lights as I'm setting my camera. In most cases I handle lights and cameras as I would do if I was shooting this in a real location. And normally at this stage there will be a dialogue between me and the client where I would receive feedback as I am going along and I keep adjusting my characters and cameras according to each other and keep making small micro adjustments to make sure that I have good compositions all the way through the shot. And now it's time to add some music. My idea was something similar to Edith Piaf, La Foule. The song has an amount of craziness to it that I really like and I wanted to replicate it. And so I went ahead and recorded my own version here with my keyboard in my own little studio setup. And finally, I'm going to polish the camera and the light to tweak the last little details. And voila, here's the finished part. I hope you enjoy. Croissant. <laughs>